Hey guys, welcome to Atari 37, and I'm reviewing this, which is the Fantastic Four Electronic Thing Hands from the 2005 Fantastic Four movie. Now, I bought this today, I found this at kind of like a consignment store for about $15, and uh, you know, I thought it was pretty cool, and why not review it? Uh, I really like the designs on the packaging with the Thing and the Fantastic Four, and we have Fantastic Four written here, Electronic Thing Hands, we've got this kit over here, and then you can see the Thing Hands, and it's clobbering time, and Crash, and then we have... Uh, some more designs on the uh, box. I really like the artwork on the box too. And then over here, we can see, uh, you know, the same kid using the gloves and more of that same artwork. And we can see the same sing on the side. <laughs> You can hear the sound effects going off. And then on the back, we have pretty much the same stuff all around. And I did not know that they uh, made Fing feet. I remember when these gloves came out. I was a kid when they came out, but I did not know they made his feet. So that's uh, really interesting. And they also made his mask and some human torch stuff. And here we have a bio on uh, the Fing if you want to read it. Uh, but yeah, let's open this stuff up. So, here we have the Electronic Thing Fist, and uh, if you've ever had a pair of, like, Hulk uh, fists that are kind of like this, you'll probably know what it is. It's, like, the exact same material. It's a foamy-type material, uh, but I really like the designs on it. They've done this, like, rockish design. You know, pretty much the thing is a rock, so, yeah, and they also did the four fingers, which is nice, and uh, I just really like the designs on it, and in some places, it's darker orange than it is a lighter orange, and I don't know if that's just because of, you know, like, over time, the coloring changes Bit, but I really like that because I think the theme, like, you know, I think some spots on him are a bit more darker and brighter orange. Sorry about the sound effects, they keep going off. Uh, although that's really amazing that in box for this long it still goes off. Um, but uh, yeah. And, uh, to show you the inside of them, you can just see, like, right in there, just a little handle. You know, very similar to that Hulk type material and the Hulk Buster gloves that came out for Age Voltron, but you can see the fist, and it fits on my hand pretty good, and it makes my hand actually look pretty big. It's, like, really cool. I love these old-style uh, foam glove type things they would do, and also, if you bash it, you can make some sounds. It's like... Probably definitely needs new batteries, uh, but I like that it says the thing's catchphrase, and you know, I like it makes bashing noises, and uh, yeah, overall I really like this glove set. I mean, I can't really say I'd recommend it because, you know, I mean, this came out like 13 years ago, but um, yeah, if you can find one of these or you have one, uh, totally pick it up. You know, I've recently um, found some older, like, Marvel items and DC items, and I just kind of started reviewing them. You know, it's not like really like a, you know, just a lot of reviews, just something I want to do for fun, and I might do more of these in the future um but yeah i really like this set i think it's a great two pack it's really cool and um you know uh very happy to pick up some classic fantastic four merchandise before the whole merger with marvel and we get a lot of new stuff so um yeah thanks for watching please rate like and subscribe